Hello guys, welcome to Make Easy. In this video series, and we are building a blogging application with the rights. In this video series, we are using many gems like device, SEO tools, and meta tags, breadcrumbs, and bootstrap. So many gems, and we are going to implement in this blogging application. So first, we need to start our application. So we need to create a Rails application. Rails new blog so now it is installing my gems so the application is created here I'm using sublime text so we have to open that folder blog this is my application now we are mostly working on this app folder having controllers and model in the views this is an MVC architecture and here you see the config folder and we are going to define our database things in database test environment the routes thing are routes dot rp and also here we have folder like public we can place our style sheets also we can create styles yeah, we can also use style sheets in ss folder assets folder so now here i'm generating a scaffold application for my blog so again you need to run the commands right g scaffold blog the blog having the title is the string and description is the text so first we need to move to that folder cd blog now run scaffold so i already used blocks because of my app name Okay, we use like pose. So here I got a warning the like. So the scaffold and we are going to create a model. The model always must be singular, not plural. So it automatically will take pose, not pose. But our controller is created with pose. See our controller here, controller posts, but model when you visit the model, it will create only post. Let's see our application now. It created resources posts. When you run when you run like routes, so it will show all our routes. So as the the CRUD operations like you can create, you can delete, you can update, you can create, destroy. So if you visit our views, you can see our post view. It's having the form, edit page, index page, show page and all. If you visit model, the post.rb. If you use the controller, the post controller, the post controller is it inherited from so the inheriting from application controller application controller is the root controller then you have an index so it will display all your files and def def dot show def show is the method you can display our post is according to the id so it, it, here you see the set params it will so set post here we given the params and it will take each and every, every time it will take id so so according to id the show page the article will display on show page you can create a new you can edit the create after creating if it is successfully created so it will move to posts otherwise it will keep an error means it will enter again new form this form will display so same thing for update and destroy and if you, if you visit db so it will create one the migrated file having the string is the title and the text is the description the table name is the posts now we need to create a table so you need to run 
and you need to run a command like take db migrate so it created a table for us if you visit schema.rb so it created a post table so now we can run the server rails as our rails server and the important file that is gem file this is my gem file so i'm using sans rails and s283 and rails 5.1.4 and turbo lanes these things are amazing so now i'm running on the server puma so running on puma so booting puma so now we need to visit so localhost 3000 So it's successfully completed. If we visit route post, let's see, it's a completed. Okay. So we have select the post. We are selecting a post. So the post. Now as you see, I'm going to I'm going to my routes file. Here I'm creating the root folder root. So root route means when you are you are starting an application. So you can list me the first uh, this is root page. The root the root we have to write the controller. The controller is the post. Then the page is the index page. Means here you see the views the posts index page. To now it will take. So if I refresh this one. If I refresh this one, so now automatically it will display the first post page only. Thank you guys, thanks for watching. Hope you like the video. Please subscribe.